In this video, guys, we're going to explore the question, can the right music improve your trading performance? Stay tuned. Hey guys, warm welcome to you. All right, so this is an interesting question, right? Uh, can the right music improve your trading performance? There's a few different things to look at here, and there's a few different kind of stories that I've got for you of how I've potentially, or how I have used music and how you potentially could use it too. So there's loads of studies, right? We are all probably pretty much aware that music affects our mood. We don't need to study to tell us that, do we? You can have a really up song that you enjoy kind of singing along to that makes you feel happy when I was singing the shower type songs you can have you know some kind of sad song that makes you feel kind of sad and reflective and thoughtful or whatever it may be depending on the kind of time you're listening to it and you can have a, a multitude of things that go through each single one but the point is is that music does influence our emotion and also our physical state so why could we not use music as a tool to get us into the physical state that we know is optimum for the trade trading environment we're in so for example we could kind of say and there's some of the things we need to look at here guys is what we're trying to achieve so the mood we're trying to achieve the tempo of the music the desired outcome of what we want to get out of it and potentially our heart rate or physiology and some of the kind of genres we can uh, look at there's obviously loads more there but these are some of the main ones so you might for example at the open want to be fired up and be kind of ready to go so you could have something like um one, one thing that i used to listen to quite a lot was welcome to the jungle i'm not a huge guns and roses fan i have to admit but you know welcome to the jungle just kind of really resonated with me uh, in terms of what you're doing it's like you know you're going in there people are trying to take what uh, stuff from you um and it felt you know that was kind of something that was right at the time you know do i think about the market so much now not so much i prefer to have a bit more of a kind of uh, less aggressive approach i'm not sure if that served me the best possible way i think maybe you go in there and you want to kind of combat as opposed to just waiting and and trying to sync with the market but you know it might work for you and it you know everyone's totally different so that was another thing I know a trader who would always listen to the classical motivation song of Eye of the Tiger from Rocky and he'd be there beforehand. So something that motivates you, and that could be hip hop as well, and hip hop can be quite motivational, something that motivates you before the market. Now, if we go back and kind of with the example I gave about the uh, Welcome to the Jungle with the Guns of Roses, I wouldn't listen to it just before the open. If I was doing that again and I wanted to kind of get that motivation for a day worth of kind of aggressive day trading, so I would listen to it but I would have a little bit of a break before the actual open so that you've got the motivation you're ready maybe when you're doing your prep or whatever it may be or maybe if you're kind of visualizing how you want the day to go getting yourself up and upbeat and you know sit getting your shoulders back and all that phys uh, you know all that physiology that we know helps us with our trading confidence so once you've got that little bit of a boost that little bit of a shot then you're ready to trade Okay, so some kind of thing that elevates you and gets you motivated ready before the open. So what about during the actual trading day? Well, I think then having something like that probably doesn't serve you very well. For me, the best kind of thing for the trading day is to bring everything slower to slow kind of heart rate down, to slow what you're doing down, because everything in the markets and your screens is there designed to make you more alert. You've got flashing lights there, you've got charts moving, stuff's moving, you've got news coming through, you've got this, that, the other, you've got trades going against you, trades going for you. It's all designed to up your tempo if you like, whereas if you have something that's uh, some sort of stimulant from a music perspective that brings your tempo down, you know, it just calms you a little bit more. Maybe that's a some sort of classical music. Maybe it's something that's a little bit more rhythmical, kind of when you're just sitting there, you can relax, you can kind of get yourself into the zone a lot more. I know there's been a lot of studies, not in a trading arena, but saying how classical music helps people get into that zone. And so leveraging on that, finding your favorite piece of classical music, even if you're not a big classical music fan, or some sort of relaxing piano ballad or some sort of instrumental of your favorite, that's a good one as well, guys. And you know, if you've got favorite songs, just the instrumental version, or kind of a piano version 
that's a good way of getting that classical vibe but without going full classical so that then brings your heart rate down and kind of makes sure you just relaxes you a little bit more and so you know that to me is kind of the best thing you could do during the trading day but then perhaps you need a little bit of a pick me up let's say you're trading a european session the u.s session is coming up maybe then you go back into something that gives you a little bit more of a boost for the afternoon session coming into the close so then you might put on some hip or some dance or techno or whatever it may be house garage whatever you live listen to or you enjoy that it's got a high tempo to it so it bring the tempo up brings your mood a little bit more excited makes you a little bit more alert and just prepares you then for perhaps there's something coming up that you need to be alert for non-farm payrolls or whatever the caution i would say with this guys is you don't want it to significantly make you so alert and so ready for it end up trading when you shouldn't be trading i alluded to that earlier alert yes and ready and taking all the information and processing and making a decision from it but not so much that it's forcing you to make a trade that you end up kind of uh, matching the music with i must trade it should be like okay this is music with okay i'm ready to take everything in maybe note some stuff down maybe make some trade hypothesis and that kind of thing so you know, and whatever it may be, maybe it's some, maybe, and maybe after a bad losing a few trades and you're feeling pretty, you know, pretty down by your confidence has been knocked, you've lost some money. Maybe you bring on some of the old classical singing in the shower type stuff that no one likes to admit they listen to, but some kind of pop stuff that makes you feel, yeah, you know, there's songs in the car that you sing along to, just the general upbeat kind of normal songs that you hear quite regularly on the radio. Maybe that brings your tempo up, makes you feel a bit more happy about things. Same with the hip hop. Last thing you want to do, guys, is if you're feeling down about your trades and you feel like oh man you know this is not going well and start listening to some kind of sad song ballads or love ballads or something you're just going to feel awful about it you want to try to use music to manipulate the way you feel adjust and tweak and get you out of those kind of depressing times where you're thinking oh you know what the trade's not going well it's not a great day bit of good music lift your mood up and then next day fire yourself up with something that gives you the motivation and then maybe the classical throughout the day or something a little bit more calmer so that you're ready and you're kind of there and you're focused to get you in that zone let me know your thoughts guys what music do you like to listen to before you start trading or while you start trading or do you like listen to music at all do you like silence do you even have those kind of binaural beats that you can get we can download stuff and it gives you certain different uh, frequencies in each year uh, there's loads of stuff out there to try um, but i think it's worth looking at if you like music and most people do uh, using it as a tool to kind of improve your trading take care whatever you're doing bye bye